Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am doing a nighttime routine in today's video and this is during the work week when I am working full time. I work 8 to 5 Monday through Friday as an accountant and this is just a little sneak peek as to how my nights look. I don't want to do much of a voiceover in today's video, but I did just quick want to mention to you guys that I am doing a giveaway over on my Instagram with a bunch of other YouTube mamas for a $200 Target gift card. Yes, I'm super excited to be teaming up with these other YouTube mamas. I'll have all of them linked down below for you guys as well as my Instagram so that you guys can head on over and enter that giveaway for the $200 Target gift card because come on you guys, who can't use $200 to Target? I could do that by breathing in Target. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. She 
can't see the sun. That's why we're arguing. <laughs> All right, let's go upstairs and take a bath, and then we'll snuggle and watch Sophia. After I get him all dressed in his jammies, you have crazy eyes. This black camera like scares him. Um, after I do that, I will get him um, ready to go in his swaddle. So this is the nested bean swaddle, you guys. And I told you that I would be giving you a review this month as to how I felt it worked. And I, <laughs> yes, we're happy to say we love it. We love it, don't we? Hi. Okay, so this is the Nested Bean Zen Swaddle Classic. And this is for a size small to large, seven to 18 pounds. And there is a little pocket here. See, if you look on the inside, there's like a little like pocket inside of this big pocket. Now this is, if your baby is smaller, I believe that is where baby would go is in this smaller pocket. So when they're a newborn, um, obviously Riker is a little bit bigger now he is three months old so we will put him in this bigger pocket and what's so nice about this swaddle you guys is that there are little weighted pieces so this guy right here is weighted can you hear that he's got like some beans in there like some beads some weighted beads and then also on these little side flaps it is weighted as well since I started using this swaddle Riker has been sleeping through the night. For the first night that we used it, he slept almost entirely through the night. And I was thinking, I was like, mm, like maybe, like we'll see, we'll see um, if that continues. And sure enough, from that second night forward, he slept entirely through the whole night. He never once woke up for any feedings. He was a happy little guy, went down at 8.30, 9 o'clock, and then he wouldn't wake up again until about 6.30 or 7 in the morning. Absolutely incredible. It has been a life changer for us. I will leave a link to those down below. Again, thank you to Nessed Bean for sending these swaddle sacks to us to try out. I actually, um, I reached out to them and I let them know that I was interested in the product and um, I wanted to try them out and I am blown away. Like I could cry happy tears right now. I cannot believe that my three month old is sleeping through the night. So I highly, highly recommend their um, weighted sleep sacks. I'll have all of their information down below for you guys. I mean, it has truly been like a miracle worker for us. I can't believe it. Mommy likes when you sleep through the night for me. <laughs> yeah. You sleep, I sleep, we all sleep. It's nice. Yeah, it's so nice. Especially when mommy has to get up and go to work. Mm, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look out, here she comes. That I love It's too bad you'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing her 
How I feel for her But she won't feel the same for me I've got this picture in my mind It's just the two of us Just the two of us But I know I'll have to try Try to let her go Because she won't be mine I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's giving me these feelings that I've never felt before But she will never know That I love her so well She's with somebody else and I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know, na na Never know Like she stole my heart Without knowing she did But I guess that it will pass Yeah, I can't be the only one Who got lost inside the blue of those eyes I've gotta let her go I know it won't be easy I wanna hold her close Okay guys, so it is like 9.30 now. I have just gotten into bed for my last pump of the night. Um, one other thing I wanted to quick mention in this video is I have now lowered my pump sessions to five or six per day. Um, just because of my crazy schedule, um, it works out better that way. And now that he is three months old, officially today, um, I can officially like start lowering the number of times that I pump. So this is day one experimenting how I do um, like pumping for more than like five or six hours because now I'm pumping at 6 a.m., 9 a.m., 11 a.m., 2 p.m. And then um, I haven't, so I haven't pumped since two, so it has been like seven hours. Wow, that's like a really long time for me. But, um, Another reason why I think it might be okay is because actually in the evenings and the afternoon, um, I usually don't pump a ton. My sessions get lower and lower with each pump session, so hopefully right now I'll pump like a good five, six, seven ounces. We'll see. I'll let you guys know. But um, my goal was to make it to three or four months breastfeeding. Um, I have surpassed my three-month goal as of today officially. So. Um, I'm just gonna go as long as I can and one other thing I wanted to mention quick is um, I have a kidney infection right now like a really really bad UTI and um, my whole body like I feel like my whole body is like fighting this illness off I have like zero energy kidney infections are like really hard to explain to people who haven't had them before because like it's not like a normal bladder infection like your entire body because your kidneys like filter your blood like you just feel like your entire body is like fighting this like extreme illness i don't know how to explain it so yes i recorded this video for you guys and did all this stuff like while i've been super sick i have a low grade fever and i just oh, i feel like all the energy is like being sucked out of me but um yeah, I don't know. Anyway, so that's another reason why I waited um, to pump until tonight was because I had taken my first antibiotic this afternoon and I just wanted like a good like stretch of time between like taking it and pumping. I don't know why the antibiotic I'm on is completely safe for breastfeeding, but anyways. All right, I am now officially going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this nighttime routine of a working mom. I work full time, and for those of you who do not know, my name is Morgan, and I do a lot of mommy style videos here on my channel. I work full time, I've got two kiddos, I have a three and a half year old little girl named Kaya, and then I have a three month old little boy named Riker, and um, my husband is in the shop a lot of the nights during the week because we also have a side business where we make um, rustic furniture and things like that. So. A lot of this stuff is like me, solo mommy, routining it, and yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this nighttime routine, and if you did, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up, 
and subscribe to my channel before you leave. Hit that bell notification button before you go as well so that you don't miss out on any of my future uploads. All that does is it just notifies you on your phone or wherever your device is, um, lets you know um, as soon as I upload a video. If you guys have any video suggestions, pop them in the comments below. I've been like brainstorming, trying to think of some really fun videos for you guys, especially with spring and summer coming up. So pop a comment down below with any video suggestions that you may have. And now that he's officially sleeping, I'm going to go. Okay, I'll see you guys on Sunday for a day in the life. Bye, you guys. What a wonderful world. What a wonderful world.